Good afternoon traders, welcome back by a new and the last YouTube video for this year, 2020. We had a great year with the community. Um, a lot of new traders in the community. Um, also traders with a lot of experience have joined the community in the recent years. Um, education for about five to six years for the Forest Corpus community um, till date, you know. So that is pretty, pretty great. So this YouTube video is a last video um, to give back to the Forest community. Um, did a couple of videos last month, to be honest. I'm a bad YouTuber, you know, I'm definitely a bad YouTuber. Um, did a couple of YouTube videos uh, last month, three, four. And after that, I did about four months and then seven months. So recording like 10 YouTube videos in a year, maybe, you know, but I'm not a YouTuber, I'm a trader. Um, I try to do my best, but, you know, we keep on doing what we like. And that is trading. And um, yeah, not going to sugarcoat it or anything. YouTube is not my thing, but... I'm doing it for the fun and to give a little bit back to the forest community. Uh, you know, that is the idea about why I sharing my YouTube videos when I feel the need for and when I have the dedication to record a nice educational video because almost all videos are pretty educational. You can um, pick your um your knowledge from it, from it, even if you're not a member of my community, which is fine, you know, which is definitely fine. Uh, not everyone is able to join. So, you know, if you're looking for free stuff, it's out there on the YouTube channel. And um, yeah, there is enough content out there, you know, on the internet. Uh, of course, not everything is that good or that strong um, or that real in terms of the knowledge, the education, you know. Um, yeah, it depends, you know, we trading supply in a month and that is also what I teach. That is what I do for a lot of years successful. Um, the Forest Corpus community count over 5,000 members on the entire globe uh, that we have building up over the last five to six years, which is pretty great. I'm pretty proud of it as well. Uh, and I can definitely say we have traders from every continent of this world. So that is, yeah, that's something I'm really proud of, you know, uh, something I'm really proud of. Um, and, and then the reason why I created this education, because we all know there was, there was a lot of content available on the internet, uh, but a lot of content is also lacking behind, definitely, um, you know, teaching you the basic stuff, like how to draw and support your resistant line and, um yeah, you know, don't give you any clue on why you're buying on a support or resistant level uh, in terms of technical analysis, you know. Um, there's also a little thing that, that really irritates me a little bit, you know, that there are plenty of mentors, educators out there, which is great. I respect everyone. But if you teach uh, someone something, uh, make sure you give them the right knowledge, okay? It is really, really important in my opinion. Um you know, otherwise you're going to lag behind, you're going to, you're going to apply the wrong stuff, you know, um, and trading is definitely not easy, you know, if you ask me. So I think it's important that you get the right knowledge, you know, learning the right knowledge. Um, you always see me saying on the internet, uh, on the social media channels, uh, unlearn to learn, you know, uh, because most traders that join me have joined with multiple other educators, which is great. You can gain knowledge from everywhere. Uh, but some, like I said, some things are not that um, that good. So they they need to unlearn a behavior where they are using for, for multiple months or years and then um, relearn, learn the right knowledge, you know. So that is a little bit the ID, uh, which is pretty hard because, um, you know, if you have learned something, it's pretty hard to unlearn it again, you know, also with, for the mind and, you know, for the mental as aspect, you know, and you will keep repeating the, the mistakes you did in the past. But yeah, that is why I provided this education uh, for all those years, give people the, the, the right knowledge um, to apply it, you know, and I'm not teaching the, the basics um, like supportive resistance. I do teach how to apply it, but 
uh, there is more than only buying on the support and selling on the resistant. Um, we do supply in a month. It's pretty different, you know. It's 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 that's more like institutional levels um, within your charts. You know, I see everything in orders instead of an an, an, an basic horizontal line. For example, you can map out multiple lines, and I will show you. You can map out multiple lines. You can add a, add a line right here. You can add a line right here, you know, and this is simply supporting resistant levels. But there is more. Within these levels, there is supply in the month areas. And I believe that this is the most powerful thing out there in terms of um, trading as a retail trader, uh, in terms of technical analysis, okay? So you can map out hundreds of lines in your chart, but if you have no clue... Uh, where to buy and where to sell and why why to buy and why to sell where is the liquidity in the market stuff like that you need to identify this stuff where are there high potential trade setups incoming you know so it's keep an it 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 it, it, it remains an, an probability game you know trading if you ask me um but you can you can definitely increase your chances you know if you know how to spot the right um, levels in the market, and it all starts with supply and demand, in my opinion, but everyone can have a different vision on that, you know, everyone can different vision on that, but uh, yeah, it pays out for me and it pays out for a lot of traders within the community, um, you know, so retail trading. Um, yeah, for example, right now it's end of the year. We're seeing, uh, for example, on gold, I did a post on Instagram uh, yesterday as well on my timeline. More than likely a lot of traders you have seen it. Um, yeah, gold is in a consolidation area right now. It's end of the year. Uh, volume is going away. Uh, holidays were also there and remain there. Um, more than likely for a lot of you traders is the last trading day of this year. Uh, yeah, I already stopped myself with trading for a couple of, uh, couple of days. So, and I will, will remain trading from the mid of January. Uh, I do this every year, taking a little break, going on a nice holiday with the family and uh, enjoying life. Um, for example, um, yeah, you can identify it on, uh, a nice level right here you know this is a nice and powerful um supply level okay um, you, know, you can see the nice leg to the downside you can see prices turning back trading to the downside first opportunity prices turning back for the second time second opportunity short right here into the 1900 area and price turned back to the downside okay and I will give you another example. Um, yeah, we can spot a level right here, for example. And you can see multiple buying opportunities right here. This is also in, uh, in the month level, for example, you know. So don't, um, don't get confused. Supply in a month is not support and resistant, okay? Um, you can see how the the market spikes in these levels and yeah sh and you can see that shift in momentum is coming okay you can definitely see it um if we mapping out this high right here this price range between this demand level and this um yeah this level of liquidity right here you can see this is still a nice 100 to 110 120 pip range you know so definitely a strong area right here definitely a strong area right here okay and you can and you can see that selling and buying climaxes uh within between this uh, supply and amount areas okay um and i agree within these levels you can identify multiple support and resistant levels you know that is definitely an an thing but critical levels for me are definitely supply and amount trading areas okay so definitely um yeah like i said we we count over almost five thousand members right now from all across the globe uh, i i planning for 2021 ahead and i want to increase this increase this numbers i want to reach out to as many traders possible over all the world you know 
and providing them with the, the education, quality education, something they can learn from, something they can find their consistency with, you know. Uh, I think that's the most important thing, you know, providing people with the right knowledge, okay. Already explained it a couple of minutes ago, but so I will not repeat myself. Um, and next to that, we have also a great community available, you know, a great community available. Uh, yeah, with a lot of knowledge, you know, with a lot of, with a lot of knowledge to work uh, with like-minded traders and like-minded individuals from all across the globe. Um, so this was, this is the, the, the 20, the 2020 chat, you know, this is the 2020 chat. And um, I keep this open for a little while. I was planning to close this chat uh, end of this year, but there is a lot of value uh, given in this chat, you know? So, uh, yeah, I think it's important to keep this chat open for a while, as long as the quality can uh, secure it, you know, uh, because that's the most important thing. Uh, it doesn't need to become a messy chat. It needs to become a quality chat, something extra next to the education, because the core focus should be on the education, because you're here to, to learn and to increase your knowledge and find your consistency with trading, you know. Um, yeah, some people will see that in financial freedom or anything like that, or making an extra income or making a main income. And it's all possible, you know. I'm not selling dreams to everyone. Trading is hard work. It's a lot of, um, it's a lot of fears and errors according to your trading journey, you know. So you're going to fight your demons in your head. You need to become disciplined, uh, the mental aspect behind trading and all that stuff. But once again, with the right knowledge and the right education, it's all possible. So we're going to move forward in 2021. And um, yeah, the community will become even bigger. Uh, but quality over quantity, you know. So keep it in mind. So this chat will be open still for new members uh, at least in January, February, and maybe March. Let's see how this continues. Uh, we count over almost 2,000 traders in this chat only. Um, so yeah, keep it in mind. Quality chat, lovely conversations, positive vibes. Um, yeah, you know, so that is how we like to see it. And gold is spiking to the upside again. Beautiful. Um, that is the plan for... 2021, uh, providing more people with knowledge, providing more people with education. And uh, yeah, you can see market was moving sideways for a couple of days because we're losing the volume in the market. But yeah, you know, it's not impossible to trade it. You can see, you can, like I said, it's almost 110, 120 pip uh, trading range. And I do expect if price will break this high right here, that price will move to the 1900s area. Uh, again, you know, again, definitely. So, uh, yeah, we can also take a look to GBP, GPY, for example. Um, yeah, we can see also a little ranging market, right? You can also see a little ranging market. So, we have this level right here and we have this level um, right here. Okay, market is moving sideways a little bit. We count still over an 80 pip pip range, you know. So some traders decide to trade for till the end of the year, which is fine. If that's your plan, it's your plan. Some traders, uh, yeah, using this time to uh, relax, uh, recharge for upcoming year and depending on new and great uh, movements in the markets, you know. So, uh, yeah. This is there was the last video for this year. Uh, little explanation on supply and demand areas and how the community works at, and uh, yeah, that's it. You know, um, will I will plan to do um, more than likely again a few YouTube videos. Uh, you know, within this new year with some new content. You know. So once in a while, as you can see, once in a month, twice a month, something like that. So I will continue to do that because I like it, you know, but um, I'm not a consistent YouTuber or anything like that. Um, core focus for me was always the education, was always the community. And uh, also a little bit on Instagram, Facebook, stuff like that, Twitter. I like it. I enjoy it, doing it. So uh, definitely. Okay. I wish you all 
a happy new year, a blessed happy new year. Let's make the best of it. And uh, yeah, maybe we see you soon on the other side. Much love. Bye-bye. <laughs>